Hello, today we're reading Coloured Hills by Tamara Grandokwa Kwasha and illustrator Nazar Abu Al Halloween. This is Kuman. He lives in a village on a hill where everything is yellow. One day, Kuman's ball rolled down the hill. He ran to catch it. When he arrived at the bottom, he was amazed at what he saw. He'd never seen this new colour before. Hello, I am Cummin, he said to a girl he met. What is your colour? I am a niece, she replied. I am blue. That is a beautiful ball. Could we trade? Okay. I have never seen that strange colour before. It is yellow, Cummin said with a smile. But when Cumin returned to his village, people said the ball was scary, horrible, and weird. The village leader asked, where did you get this ball, Cumin? I traded it with a girl I met down the hill. Down the hill? This ball may be dangerous. We must return it now. When the yellow people reached the valley, they were surprised to see what the people there looked like. Cumin said, Look, they are just like us. The village leader said, No, they do not look like us. They cannot replicate our unique dance moves. We spin, we clap, we put our arms in the air. The village leader called out, We can do that. We can spin, we can clap our hands, we can put our hands in the air. But you cannot replicate our special song. We sing like this. Toot, 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 beep, 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 dum, dum, dum. Yes, we can, and the yellow people sang. Toot, 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 beep, 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 dum, dum, dum. The blue village leader said, maybe we are similar after all. The yellow village leader added, yes, maybe. Cumin stood between them and shouted, I think we are similar enough to play football together. Let's go! The leaders agreed. People from both villages played, laughed and had a great time. The match ended in a tie. Then the blue leader invited the yellow village to visit any time. They met a few days later and exchanged beautiful gifts. It wasn't long before they met again and again. Civica has really demonstrated its commitment to driving literacy and the habit of reading through a very unique project in Singapore that we've been running now for over 15 years. Across 350 schools, we provide the library system and the librarians that drive that literacy culture. Um, that has encouraged the children to adopt reading as a habit and one of the big factors has been encouraging the parents to read to the children from a very early age. And of course this all supports a Singaporean strategy of learning for life.